It's Vice Night this Tuesday in Miami. Sam Houston State at Florida International. Miami Vice-themed uniforms and stadium. It's going to be pretty cool. We'll talk about that in a moment. But more importantly, I do have a free winner for you, a free play in this Tuesday night ESPNU game in just a moment. Hi, this is Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, right back here on Wager Talk TV, breaking down your 7.30 Eastern game this Tuesday night, October the 22nd. National TV, of course, Conference USA action, prime time on the weeknights. This one is on ESPNU at 7.30 Eastern. We do have Sam Houston State currently about a five and a half point road favorite at Florida International. Total open 45 and a half, up to 47. This line opened as high as seven. It's been bet down to five and a half. Um, I actually like the Sam Houston side, but this line is way too high. I make the game more around maybe a pick em, so I'm not touching the side. I'm going to recommend the total for you here in this video, and I agree with that sharp money coming in on the over 45.5, currently up to 46.5, 47.5. I think there's still wiggle room. There's still line value over 47 or less as I project this game to get into the 50s. One of the reasons the total's a little bit lower than normal is because starting quarterback Keon Jenkins was injured last week for Florida International. It's one of the reasons they lost outright as a seven-point road favorite last Wednesday night against a winless at the time UTEP team. Um, he is expected to be back. They had four turnovers, a really bad showing. So there is some question marks on the Florida International side, but this line is way too high. However, I don't want anything to do with the line value because Sam Houston State holds a substantial edge on the line of scrimmage here, and they should be able to run the ball with success. And in college football, if I can get a team in a less than a touchdown price range that's going to have a dominating rushing performance, that usually makes my list. Unfortunately, that's been priced into this point spread, so I think the total is the best option in this game Tuesday night. I do like the over 46.5 to 47. I talk about that Sam Houston State rushing attack. They're a run-based offense. In fact, they rush for more yards than they throw. 220 per game on the ground, just 180 passing, and they do it quite well, almost five yards per carry, and Florida International has struggled this year against the run, giving up almost five yards per carry and over 200 rushing yards per average uh, per game on average, so Sam Houston State will be able to run the ball, and that'll lead to some offensive success. Uh, I do expect those starting quarterback, Keon Jenkins, to be back once again for Miami of uh, Florida International, that is. I look for a decent effort from them also offensively. Sam Houston State this year has given up 25 points a game, 5.3 yards per play. They, they haven't really been tested. Uh, this Florida International squad, by the way, at home this season, averaging 37 points a game so far. I look for both teams to get some points. Best play is probably a Sam Houston team total over 27 or less. Um, I know some of you probably don't have access to team totals, so that's why I just gave you the game total. But once again, I think Sam Houston's team total over could be worth a look, and the game total over 46.5, 47 is worth a look as well. I look for Sam Houston State to have success running the ball, but unfortunately, the point spread is too high, so we're going to look at the total in this one, and I like the over on Tuesday night football, 7.30 Eastern on ESPN. Now, this, of course, is in Miami of Florida, and I mentioned how it's Vice Night. In fact, if you go to the school's website, they got a pretty cool picture. The uh, uniforms look Miami Vice themed white with the uh, neon yellow and teal blue, and they're on a speedboat. So I'm actually kind of excited to watch this Tuesday night game. I don't get too excited for Conference USA Tuesday nights normally, but this one might be worth checking out. Hey, comment below. I'm 50. I've watched Miami Vice throughout the years. I watched it when it was on live back in the 80s, and I watched the reruns quite often as well. Uh, definitely a great show. Probably one of the best intro songs in the history of television. Uh, I'm getting going right now. What are your thoughts? Are you old enough to remember Miami Vice? Did you like it? Crockett or Tubbs? Are you a Crockett or Tubbs man? Um, a Castillo, Sergeant Castillo as well. A great show, but it should be a fun game. And once again, I do think the over has some value here if you're looking to play this on Tuesday night. Comment below, though. I do read all the comments. I reply back. I love the interaction here and the support on Wager Talk TV. If you're liking these free play videos, I'm trying to do every weeknight of the season for you in college and pro football. We've done it for the last several weeks. I've got your Wednesday night and Thursday night and Friday night college football previews. Thursday night NFL, 4-1 and one the last five weeks since I started posting those every week. We've got this week's game as well. Also, Sunday and Monday night football videos. I've got you covered here on Wager Talk TV. So do me a favor. Comment below. Let me know if you want to keep seeing these free play, free play videos. I'll keep them coming. But also, hit the thumbs up like. It literally takes one second. Boom, you did it. Thank you. Thumbs up like does do a great deal to keeping all this content free here on Wager Talk TV. Also, make sure you subscribe and you click that bell for an instant alert. So you know when these free play videos are posted each and every day throughout the week. And don't forget, pro basketball starts this week, starts on Tuesday. It is here, Tuesday night. Yes, we have this game, but we also have some NBA for the first time, regular season. And I'm number one the last three years combined and number one all time in the history of the wagertalk.com website in units one in the NBA. Pro basketball is here, my friends. Baseball playoffs are still going. The World Series is about to start this week. 
I've been smoking them in baseball. 3-0 last week in the playoffs. We finished the regular season 31-13 and run on best bets. College and pro football. We had our first down weekend, really maybe the season, I think. It's been quite a while. We entered Saturday on a 10-3 and college football run. Now we're 11-6. and It happens, right? But we're still just smoking them up 170 units all sports profit this calendar year. And I bring that up because this is your last chance on Tuesday night to get the rest of 2024 all sports for free. I made this offer last week. Tons of you have gotten on board and you've gotten the rest of this year for free. You've already gotten five or six days. Don't delay. You can still get the rest of October, November, and December for free when you sign up in advance for my 2025 annual All Sports All Access Pass. Look, if you want to take a serious long-term investment approach, you need the one-year pass. But why wait until New Year's Day? Don't make that resolution on New Year's Day on December 31st, January 1st. Make your New Year's resolution now to take a consistent approach in 2025. Buy the one-year pass, and you're going to get the next two-plus months included for free as an added bonus. But that bonus expires tonight on Tuesday. No promo code needed. Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Hey, get there quicker with shortcut wt.buzz slash sm. Don't forget to follow me on X and Instagram. Getting more active on Instagram. Who knew? That's right. I'm on IG. You can follow me on X and Instagram at Steve Merrill, two R's, one L, at Steve Merrill on X and Instagram. And don't forget also when you're checking out that one year all access special to get the rest of this year free, You can see all my current results, all my plays. You can click on the analysis on the past plays. They're all in the last 20 section at wagertalk.com on my homepage. And also check out the daily free plays I post throughout the week. We'll get more active now that the NBA is here on a daily basis. Just a great time to be an All Sports All Access client. The next couple weeks is the only time of the year that football, baseball, and basketball is all going at the same time. And you can get that for free with the rest of this year when you sign up for 2025. Take a serious long-term investment approach. It works out to about a dollar per play. For every football, baseball, basketball, college, and pro best bet for the next 14 and a half months. Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Be sure to check uh, the click, once a click subscribe and hit the bell for instant alerts. I've got Wednesday, Thursday, Friday college football videos. Also Thursday, Sunday, Monday night NFL. NFL fade the public this weekend. College football top 25. Woo! We're going to be busy. And I love it. We're have NBA free play videos coming up soon as well. So stay tuned right here to Wager Talk TV for more great free content coming up next.